you do it? I don't understand. How will you bag into my office, crying and saying nonsense? So, sir, you still failed me. After I begged you, just because I didn't sleep with you, you failed me. Now I have to spend one more year in this university carrying over a course I studied hard for. Are you blaming me? I gave you a choice to sleep with me and get good grades, but you insisted. You choose your own path. <laughs> but it is against my faith to do such a thing. I'm already engaged to someone. I will feel guilty if I do it. That's your luck. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to report you to the school authority. You want to go and report me? Go ahead and do that. If anyone will even believe you, I'm a man of high cannibal. No one will even listen to you. Talk more of believing you. <laughs> you will surely regret this. <laughs> I've seen girls like you, foolish girl. Ah, Bumi, guess who I ran into today? So, uh -uh. Bumi, what's the problem? Why are you crying? <laughs> you won't understand. Please, Bumi, talk to me. I'm your best friend. Talk to me. I... I, I lost a loved one today. Someone really, really close to me. Oh my god. Sorry, dear. You'll be fine. You know what? Go and freshen up. We are going to a party. I don't feel like going anywhere. Come on, Bumi. You can't stay in your room and cry all day. Go freshen up. Alright, I will. By the way, how did this loved one die? Please, I, I don't want to talk about it. Okay, if you say so. For the love I have is so real How can I <laughs> Bad guy You can say that again <laughs> I thank God I'm a lecturer I wouldn't have been enjoying all these girls <laughs> I know right But some of these girls like proving stubborn uh, uh, Is that one a problem to you? If they are even proving stubborn then fail them. Simple. It's not as easy as that. What about those decent girls who read at night? Those serious ones, I can fail them because they refuse to sleep with me. Who cares? It's their luck. There are two choices. Either you sleep with me or you fail. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I said you are a bad guy. Look, those stubborn ones are nothing to me. All they will do is to cry and threaten me. That they will report to the school authority but do you know what i'll tell them i'll tell them that the school authority won't listen to them considering a man of my cannibal <laughs> wisdom you will not kill me you i plan on upgrading the collecting bribes i want to buy the latest bins <laughs> are you serious Ayomide, please stop. What is it now? Am I not your boyfriend? Can't I trust you? Uh, um, Ayomide, look, I am not ready yet. We are still getting to know each other better. I mean, we just started dating. What? Bumi, we have been together for four good months now. And you have never in your life let me trust you. I, I, I get where you are coming from. But it's for your own good. You have to understand me. I'm not ready yet. Hmm. Bumi, you should understand that I'm a man and I have needs. I'm telling you now. <sighs> Ayo, 
it's okay. I love you. I just want you to know that all I'm doing is for your own good. I don't want to lose you. Uh, I don't want to understand all this rubbish you are saying, you know. <laughs> you want to understand. <laughs> Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. How are you? I'm not fine, sir. What is the problem? Sir, I submitted my assignment, but when they shared all the assignment back to us, I couldn't find mine. Oh, I see. I think it will be in my office. See me in my office later. Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. I personally took your assignments. If you want to get it back, you have to sleep with me. You know that is what determines your grade. Alright sir, I will. Okay, I'll send you the address later. You'll meet me there later tonight. Alright sir. I love girls like you that don't stress me. <laughs> Thank you sir, I'll take my leave now. What a smart girl. <laughs> Come, let's go on our phone. No, thank you. This is the only thing that brought me to this university, and I'll focus on it. Okay, then. Well, chess to us who doesn't care about the exams because we already don't need for the lecturers. I don't even care about what you are saying. Please, I need to read. And why will you suffer yourself when you can get things the easy way? Look at you now. You are well packaged. No worries. I prefer to get things the hard way. Please, I really need to read. You are distracting me. Suit yourself. You see, I don't even know what all the government officials are doing. I know, right? <laughs> Look at that gear. Look at the way she's well packaged. My eyes have been on her ever since I noticed her. Ah, she's one of my students too. I wonder why I haven't noticed her. Why will you notice her when you are busy with girls every day? <laughs> you are not serious. But if you want her, go and tell her now. You know what to do. What if she refuses? Come on. Then you feel her. No, I can't. She's one of those serious students who focus on their books. I can't pay her. You are too scared. Who cares if she's one of those serious students? If she refuses, you fail her. Simple. You are a bad guy. <laughs> Is it today you realize? <laughs> Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, girls. How are you? We are fine, sir. Um, you, what's your name? My name is Bumi. Bumi? Okay, okay. I want you to see me later in my office. Okay, sir. Good, good. Uh-uh. What have I done that he wants to see me? Did I do anything wrong? So you don't know? I don't understand. No what? My dear, you are lucky. Look. I don't understand what you are saying. How am I lucky? There will be no need for you to redo. Because if you do what he tells you to do, you will pass. Niniola, go straight to the point now. You are making me more confused. So you don't know. Anytime lecturer calls female student to his office, just know that he wants to sleep with them. And what if I refuse? Then that means you all pay his course. You have to spend an extra year in the university carrying over his course. <sighs> No, 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 no. My case is different. I'm not sure he called me for that reason. Well, we hope so. Good luck. No, no. Be positive. He didn't call you for that reason. <sighs> Sir, 
Sir, you sent for me. Um, yes, I did. Okay, let me go straight to the point. You see, a beautiful girl like you should not be stressing yourself reading for exams when you can pass exams without reading. Sir, you can't pass exams without reading. How is that possible? I'm sure you must have heard about me. You know what to do. I'll write the address where you meet me there later tonight. Let's run things. <laughs> Sir, you want me to sleep with you? No, I can't. I can't do that. It's for your own good though. You are not ready. You know you are in your final year and you wouldn't want to carry over a course to another year. You know your success depends on me. Uh, um, sir, I will think about it. Okay, think about it. But know that I am not a patient man. See, I'm going to spend all my money on you. <laughs> Are you serious? What about Bumi? Oh, come on. Forget about that one. I don't really like Bumi. It is you I want. It's you. <laughs> so, where will you be giving me money to make my hair? You will send your account number. I will transfer it into your account before you go. Aww. Thanks, dear. You're the best. Mwah. <laughs> <laughs> what? What is going on here? Umi, what is your owner? Can't you see I'm having a nice time with this lovely lady? <laughs> Adetola, you! You my best friend! You of all people! You went behind my back and snatched my man away from me! Hey, 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 hey! I am not your man, so just forget it. Is it because I didn't let you touch me? That's why you went to meet my friend? Yes, that's the reason. So please leave me alone. Just forget about me. <laughs> you will surely regret it. Don't mind her. Forget about her. <laughs> I don't care about her. Oh, no, Lufer, angel of my life. For the love I have is so real How can I be that Mr. Right? <laughs> Hi, Adetola How could you do this to me? How? You're supposed to be my best friend Please, Bumi, I don't have time for all these Jokokotai tears Please leave me alone <laughs> Tola you were supposed to be my friend. You betrayed me. You took my man away from me. It's not my fault. He said he doesn't love you. That is, it's me that he wants. Do you want me to argue with him? Please get out of my house. <laughs> oh my god. life treating me like this why how can my own best friend do this to me now i have nobody left who do i talk to god why all this now <sighs> niniola i don't know what to do he said he's going to fail me if i refuse so what am i going to do now but I can't. I just can't. What if I talk to him? I'll beg him. If you like, beg, cry, I roll on the floor for 100 years. He won't even listen to you. I'll just try. There's nothing bad in trying. Okay, oh, I wish you good luck. But don't say I did not want you. Hmm. <sighs> What is the problem, my daughter? Why are you crying? It's, it's my lecturer in school. 
What happened to your lecturer? He failed me. He failed me just because I refused to sleep with him. Now I have to carry over the course to next year. <laughs> what? How can he do that? Kansi, you can't carry over that course. You can't. Your sister stayed at home because of you. You know we don't have money. Mama, what do I do? What do I do? <laughs> don't worry, my daughter. Wipe your tears. Everything will be fine. I will go and beg him. I will follow you to your school tomorrow. O okay, Mama. If I, if I, if I, I'm gonna love you till I die. Oh, Lord, look for me. I'm thinking about that day. It'll be just you and I. Yeah, will you be my wife? Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, sir. Ah, good afternoon, madam. Cassie, how can I help you? My daughter told me that you failed her for a course that she passed. She has to carry over the course to next year. Please help us. Well, you see, your daughter here knows what to do. Cassie, what is that? Mama, it's that thing that I told you about. Ha! Huh? Sir, please. She can't do that. Please help us. Sir, I'm begging you. Please help us. Her sister stopped school because of her. Ah, uh, madam. You don't have to do that. Don't worry. I'll do something about it. Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. You think bringing your mother to beg me would change my mind, Abby? <laughs> you are not ready to pass. You think you are smart. Foolish girl. Nonsense. You see, everything is done. Don't just worry yourself again. Hmm, Mama, I don't think he agreed though. You don't know that man. What? After all my kneeling and begging? Mama, you don't know that man. If you like, kneel from now to tomorrow. He won't listen. What is even wrong with him? Hmm. Bumi, how are you? <laughs> I'm fine, sir. I'm sure you have thought about it. So, what time are we meeting? Sir, I'm sorry. I can't do that. I can't do what you're asking me to do. It's for your own sake. I can't do it. You are not serious. Get ready to fail. Now get out of my office. Please, sir. Please. I'm begging you. Please. I said get out of my office. Oh, okay, sir. I'll do it. I'll do it. <laughs> now you are talking. Good girl. I'll test you the address later. You meet me there later tonight. Okay, sir. But, sir, there is something I need to tell you before then. Oh, come on. We'll see later tonight. You tell me whatever you want to tell me there. <laughs> okay. I'll take my leave now. Uh uh, guy, I saw Bumi leaving your office. What happened now? <laughs> You're supposed to know why girls come to my office now. So, did she agree? Ah, uh, before Uncle, she agreed just like that. As a matter of fact, we are meeting this night, so I need to save a lot of energy. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you need to. I need you to eat. That girl has never done that kind of thing to any lecturer. She has never given. No one ever resists me. No one. Definitely no one. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, 
<laughs> you are here. That's good. Alright, let's start. Sir, before we start, there is something I need to tell you. No, come on. I can't wait. I don't have time. Ah, I had a good time. Bumi, you are so sweet. Eh, uh -huh. you said you wanted to tell me something. So, what is it? There will be no need for that since you have already slept with me. Wait, wait. I don't understand. I have slept with 20 different men and each of them that slept with me died after 7 days. You... You are making me scared. So, what, what are you trying to say? What are you trying to say? Any man that sleeps with me dies after 7 days. I was trying to tell you but you didn't want to listen. I don't know what is wrong with me. What? You should have told me now. You should have warned me. I, I tried to. So, I'm going to die in 7 days time. Oh my god, what do I do? Hey, I'm finished. Ah ah, Bumi, where are you running to? Why are you rushing as if someone is pushing you? We have exams, remember? Oh, is that why you are rushing? You have got things covered. You are going to pass even if you don't write anything. I don't care. I'm going to write the exams. Well, as for me, I'm just going to go to the exam hall and pet my nails. <laughs> as you wish. <laughs> All the love I have is so real How can I be that mistake? Me? You have been avoiding me since. Is there a problem? Sir, what do you want again? You have done what you want to do with me. Please, tell me what you said last night was a joke, please. And what was that? You said any man that sleeps with you will die after seven days. Oh. I really wished it was a joke. I'm even going to the village today to seek spiritual help. Um, is there anything I can do to stop it from happening? Please. I'm sorry. There's really nothing you can do. Hey, hey. What do I do? Why me? I'm doomed. I don't know what to do. I don't. So I'm going to die after seven days. Hey! You worry too much. See the way that girl just put fear in your body. What do you mean? I'm going to die after seven days and you are telling me that she is putting fear in my body. My friend, it's psychological. If you believe that you are going to die after seven days, then you will. That girl just said that because she was hot that you slept with her. Are you sure? Of course I am. Relax. Don't think about it. I won't. Eh, uh -huh. there is this girl that will be coming. If you see her, eh, uh, she's well packaged. <laughs> Are you not tired? <laughs> <laughs> Good day, sir. Good day, pretty girl. So, let's not waste time. I will write you the address and you'll meet me again later tonight. Okay, no problem. I'll meet you later. <laughs> Such a good girl. Sir, so what's the problem? Are you not interested in doing it again? I don't know. I just feel weak all of a sudden. I just feel turned off. It's so strange. Why is it that it's my turn that all these things will be happening to you? Sir, we have to continue like this so I don't want you to fail me. Just get out of this place. But sir, you will fail me. Please sir, let's just continue. I said get out! Alright, I'm leaving. God, what is happening?
My husband, what's the problem? Why are you not sleeping? You've been moody since you came from work. It's nothing, it's nothing. I'm not just feeling sleepy. It's okay, dear. I understand. Just try and get some sleep, okay? You have work tomorrow. Alright, dear. My husband is dead! My husband is dead! Please wake up! You can't be dead! You can't! Take out, my friend. It is not the end of the world. Everything will be alright. Hey! How will everything be fine when my husband is dead? How? What is happening here? Why is my wife crying? Who are they mourning? Ah! Ah! It is me, oh! But I am not dead now. No one can even hear me. Hear me? Hear me, my wife. I am not dead. No! 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 Ah, honey, what's the problem? It's nothing. I just had a nightmare. Oh, it's normal to have a nightmare. Yeah, but this one is really a bad nightmare. Hmm. <sighs> Honey, I want to ask a question. Okay, what is it? Should nightmares be taken seriously? Yeah, they should. As for me, I take my nightmares very serious. I'm thinking about that day. It'll be just you and I. Yeah, will you be my wifey? Unku, I don't know what to do, seriously. You messed up big time. And the fact that you didn't tell me about it. My friend told me that there is no such thing like that. And you believed it, my dear. We are in Africa. All things happen. I couldn't even sleep with a girl and my nightmare. All this makes sense now. What do I do? Oh my god. Go and meet your friend now. Let him help you. Uncle na, uncle, I'm sorry. Please help me. Please. It's my life here. That is at stake. Hmm, it's okay. I'll take you to a native daughter whenever you're ready. I am ready. I am 100% ready. Let's go now. Okay, if you say so. Hmm, what you did was a very formidable thing to do. I did not know. Assuming I knew things would turn out this way, I wouldn't have just done it. Well, it's a waste of time to cry over spilled milk. Um, Baba, is there anything else we can do? No, there is nothing you can do. Hey, God, so I'm going to die in seven days. Yes, you will die in seven days' time. Ah, I'm finished. Baba. There need to be a way out. Well, we can appease the gods. Okay, let's do that, let's do that. But you need to do two things. I will do anything, anything. Firstly, you need to go and ask for forgiveness from your wife. Your wife's spirit is very angry and she won't let us carry out the sacrifice. Secondly, the girl you slept with, you need to bring her here. She needs to be here when you perform the sacrifice. Okay, the girl will be here. But my wife, will she be able to forgive me who hurted me? <sighs> Baba, is there no any other way out? There is no other way. The gods have spoken. Close to me, and I did not know. Love that I seek for many years was right beside me, yet I could not feel it. When I close my eyes, what do I do? Will my wife ever forgive me? Even if she does, will she forgive me wholeheartedly? Come here. Come and sit on my leg. You are very, very beautiful. I can't wait to have you. <laughs> I know, right? 
What? What is going on here? I I, I have to go now. Honey, why? How could you do this to me? You are shitting on me again. Again. I am sorry, my dear. I don't know what came over me. You don't know what came over you. You will know when I'm done telling the school authorities. Ah, uh, please, don't tell them. If you tell them, I will lose my job. I will have no source of income. It's better you get sacked, so that you stay at home with me and won't have any opportunity to shit again. Please, I want to do it again. I won't. That's what you say every time. I'm tired of hearing it over and over again. Have I not been a good wife to you? Have I not? You have, my dear. Please, don't question your good qualities. I promise I will never do it again. And what if you do? Then, divorce me. Leave me. I swear, I will never ever cheat on you again. Hmm. Okay, oh, I have heard you. But if you do it again, I will never forgive you. What do I do? I really hope she forgives me. I really hope she does. Flow you to me, my girl. I thought it was an everlasting love. But it hurt me to see you go. You made me cry. When you said you were going, I cried. Really, how could you do this to me? How? I'm sorry, dear. I want to do it again. Oh, spare me that. I've heard that a lot. You will end up doing it again. Please, forgive me, Kemi. Please, Kemi. You remember your promise the last time? You swore. Honey, you swore never to shit on me again. Now you are doing it again. I tried. For years now, we've been married yet no child. You couldn't even think of that. You went out there and started shitting on me. Please, Kemi. Please, do this for my sake. Please, I don't want to die. But what about me? If I forgive you, I'm going to die mentally. Yeah, y yes, yes, you said that. Well, that is exactly what I want to do now. I'm going to pack my things. I'm leaving you for good. <laughs> ah. 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 Please, give me, please. Don't do this to me, please. Don't do this. Please, give me. You were close to me and I did not know. Baba, my wife has refused to forgive me. I'm not even sure she will forgive me. You are playing with death. You have about six days to leave and you are seeing your wife refuse to forgive you. Is there anything else we can do? You can cast a spell on her to make her forgive me. No, no, no. But, Baba, why? Yes, I can be able to cast a spell on her to make her forgive you physically. But I can't make her forgive you spiritually. We need the consent and approval of her spirit. So go and make her forgive you wholeheartedly. Not know the love that I seek for many years was right beside me. Oh my god, why do I feel so dizzy all of a sudden? I've been feeling dizzy and nausea for days now. I need to go and see a doctor. I should not play with my health. Hmm. We're close to me, and I did not know the love that I seek for many years. Was right beside me, yet I could not feel it when I closed my eyes. Doctor, what does the test result show? What is wrong with me? Congratulations, madam. The test result shows that you are two weeks gone. Two weeks gone? What do you mean by I am two weeks gone? Well, you are two weeks pregnant. Oh my god. If you excuse me, there are some patients I need to attend to. God, not now. Close to me and I did not know I don't know what to do. I don't just know what to do. My wife has refused to forgive me. She's so hot. You should be lucky to have a wife like that. She's a very wonderful woman. For her not to forgive you means you have hurt her a lot. 
Yeah, I really have. She have caught me many times, cheating, but still forgive me. But this is my life we are talking about. If she doesn't forgive me, I will die. It's okay. I'll talk to her. Please, uncle, do. Please, do. Treasure that I see. You were close to me and I did not know. Love that I seek for many years. Kemi, I know what your husband did was very bad. But you have to forgive him. Forgive and forget. It is life that is at stake. I know it will be very hard, but you just have to find a place in your heart to forgive him. Please, for my sake. <laughs> it's okay, sir. I've heard you. I I forgive him. <sighs> ah, thank you. Thank you so much. I forgive him only because I don't want the child I'm carrying in my womb to grow without a father. What do you mean by child in your womb? Yes, I'm pregnant. Ha! Ah, good. I thank you. Thank you, Lord. You were close to me and I did not know the love that I seek for me. Ayomide, what's the problem? Why are you following me up and down? Please, Pumi, forgive me. I want you back. I'm sorry for my actions. You left me for my best friend just because I refused to sleep with you. I should have just let you die. Sorry, where is Adetola? I guess she left you. She dumped me for my roommate. I thought as much. Please, forgive me, Bumi. I still love you. I'm so sorry, but I don't love you. You are a close chapter in my life. I've gotten over you. Now, if you would excuse me, I'm going to the village and I have a bus to catch. Hey, what have I done? Bumi. Please, I'm sorry. I did to love, keep me. You were close to me and I did not know The love that I seek for many years Was right beside me, yet I could not feel it Thank God, Kimi has finally forgiven me. Now the next thing to do is to bring Bumi. But where will I find her? How do I locate her? Hmm. Bumi, how was your journey? It was fine, auntie. I'll be going to the village tomorrow to meet my mother. Oh, that's good. Bumi, what is the problem? Why are you moody? Uh, auntie? Yes, talk to me. Uh, auntie, I, I, I slept with a man recently. What? Why will you? Consider your condition. You know that any man you sleep with dies after seven days. Auntie, it wasn't my fault, seriously. He's my lecturer and he told me that if I don't sleep with him, it's going to fail me. Oh dear, I'm so sorry. Your mother told me that when you get to the village, she's going to seek for spiritual help for you. I really hope it works. Yeah, I really hope so too. That says your lecturer right. He deserves it. Let him die. Yeah, you are the treasure that I see. You were close to me and I did not know the love that I seek for me. Good day, sir. Do you want to come inside? No, 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 no. Please, do you know where Bumi's village is? She stays at Ibadan. Please, where in Ibadan? I don't know. How am I supposed to know? Am I a keeper? Hmm. But does she have any relative that stays in this city? Yes, she does. Her aunt stays in the city. Please, can you write me her address? Alright, but sir, I want to ask you something. Okay. What is it? Was Bumi so good that you cannot wait to test her again? I said <laughs> write me her auntie's address and stop asking me foolish questions. Alright, sir. Sorry, sir. Okay, auntie, I'll be on my way now. I don't want to meet with the boss. Okay, Bumi. Please ask your mother for me. Alright, auntie. Safe journey. Good evening. 
Onima. Yes. Who are you? How can I help you? Please, I'm looking for Mrs. Kate. Why are you looking for her? Any problem? Are you Mrs. Kate? Yes, I am. What is the problem? Please, can you write me the address of Bumi's house in the village? Who are you and why are you asking? I am a lecturer in the university. Please, help me. How am I not sure that you are a scammer? Please, you have to believe me. I am a lecturer. I can even call the school authority so you will not doubt me. Please, this is a matter of life and death. Oh, so you are the lecturer that slept with her? Yes, I am. It's good for you. You deserve it. Please get out of my house, you wicked man. Please, madam. I'm really sorry. I've realized my mistakes. Please help me. Hmm. It's all right. I'll write the address for you. Thank you, ma. I really appreciate. You are the treasure that I see. You were close to me and I did not know. The love that I seek for many years was right beside me, yet I could Ah! Bumi, you are here. Yes, I am. How was your journey? It was fine. How is school? Well, school is fine. I just have a lot of things on my mind. I just want to be free from all those things. I don't like my condition. It's okay, dear. Now that you are in the village, we will go and seek for spiritual help. I... I, I recently slept with a man. What? How many lives want to die because of you? Mama, it wasn't my fault. It's my lecturer. He raped me. He did what? Yes, Mama, he did. He said if I don't sleep with him, he'll fail me. Another blood on my head. Mama, I'm tired. Oh, dear. It is okay. Everything will be fine. I'll be going now. All right, I'll miss you. I will miss you too. Can't I just come with you? I really wish you could, but I don't want to put you and the unborn baby under stress. Well, if you insist, but are you sure Bumi will agree to follow you to the native doctor? I'm sure she will. You see, Bumi has a good heart. She's not like that. Hmm, you are so sure. I just have the feeling that the sacrifice is not going to be successful. You worry too much, dear. Don't worry. Everything will be fine. Okay, if you say so. Safe journey. Yeah. Take care of yourself, okay? Okay, I will. You are the treasure that I see. You were close to me and I did not know. The love that I seek for many years was right beside me, yet I could not feel But what if my wife is right and Bumi refused to come with me? What if something goes wrong, like something transpires? I should have just allowed my wife to come with me. No, 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 no. I cannot put my wife and our unborn child under stress. I should think positively. The thought of me being a father is so overwhelming. Everybody, come out of this motto. Everybody. Lie down and face the ground. Your face on the ground. If I see your face, I go shoot you. Oh, yeah. You guys should bring out all your phones and money, anything valuable on you, bring them out now. We'll be the driver here. Yeah, come and drive. Come and drive. Hey, my money, my phone, everything is gone. Calm down, young man. At least you are still alive. You should be thankful for that. 
What about if he had killed us or something? You just have to be thankful. So, Baba, what is wrong with her? <laughs> this has been with her before she was born. Baba, can it be removed? <laughs> Every problem has its roots. We need to get to the roots of this problem. Okay, Baba. Please get to the roots. Something is covering me from seeing the roots clearly. I need to remove this thing. <laughs> Nothing is hidden under the sun. Now I can see it clearly. The vision is clear. You are the treasure that I see. You were close to me and I did not know. Love that I seek for many years was right beside me, yet I could not feel it. When I close my eyes. Oh my god. So you mean you got robbed? Yes, it was so terrifying. Ha! I thank God you are alive. Yeah, me too. I have to be on my way now. I need to go again. This is my life we are talking about. Okay, I'm coming with you this time. Oh, come on, dear. You can't come with me. I don't want you and our unborn child to be stressed out. Just stay at home and relax yourself. How do you expect me to stay at home and relax? Do you know how worried I was when you were gone for just a few hours? Honey, you can't come with me. Just imagine you came with me, like the first time. When the arm robber has robbed me, you wouldn't have been able to take it. It is better to come with you than to stay at home and just worry. Look, I have this feeling that Bumi isn't going to come with you. So I need to be there to talk to her, woman to woman. You have about four days left. We need to act fast. Okay, fine, you win. Come and pack your things. Okay, let me go and pack now. Oh, what your daughter is facing is as a result of you guys' carelessness. Baba, I don't understand though. You remember your husband wanted to marry a woman before he married you? Yes, Baba. I'm fully aware of that. Did you ask him the reason why he left that woman? No, Baba. I didn't. He said that it was a secret between him and his mother and you didn't show any concern towards it. That secret... Hmm... Mama, the introduction will be next week. Hmm, there's something about that gate that I don't like. Mama, what is that? I don't know. My spirit doesn't just rhyme with hers. Just don't forget about it, Mama. <laughs> you are just exaggerating. I am your mother, and I know what is wrong and right. I want you to go and see a native daughter who will tell you everything about that girl. I want to be sure you marry the right woman. Okay, Mama. I will go tomorrow, just to make you stop doubting. Alright. Baba, so that's all I have to say. Nothing more. My son, you can't marry that girl. But why? Have you had any sexual intercourse with her? Ah, uh, no. It is forbidden before marriage. No wonder you are asking me why. You are lucky you have not had anything to do with her yet. You see? That girl carries a heavy curse. Curse? What do you mean? Any man that sleeps with her dies after seven days. What? Oh my god. How come you never told me about it? You knew all along. You wanted me to die, right? I'm so sorry. The papa I went to meet said if I get married, the curse will be broken. <laughs> And the Baba I went to meet told me that if I marry you, I am going to die. Please, Sam! 
I love you. Please don't leave me. I should stay with you so that I will die. You will be alive looking for the solution to this your stupid problem. Please, it's over. The marriage, everything has been called off. My mom even warned me about you. Nonsense. <laughs> Sam, you did do this to me. Sam, you did this to me. I will never forgive you. I told you. I told you that that girl is evil, but you didn't listen to me. Now you see, you would have just died like that. Ah, Mama, I am glad I listened to you. I have called off the wedding. I don't want to marry her again. I don't want to marry her or have anything to do with her. Never again. Good. Now let me look for better, good, respectful and beautiful girl for you. I trust you, Mama. <laughs> Doctor, how is she? Congratulations, no? your wife has just given birth to a bouncy baby girl. Ah, thank God. And my wife, how is she too? She's perfectly fine, no? I thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you, Baba God. My beautiful wife, thank you so much. You just made me the happiest man on earth. <laughs> I love you. I love you so much. I love you too, dear. We are going to name the child a beautiful name. Bumi. Yeah, that is nice. Young woman, you are lucky. There is a solution now. What is it, Baba? I'm going to do anything. You will no longer be under the course, but you have to look for someone to transfer the course to. Okay, Baba, I can bring someone. It's not just an ordinary someone. You have to look for a baby, a seven-day-old baby. Carry the baby and gaze into its eyes and everything will be done. The course will be transferred to that baby and you will be free. Okay, Baba, I'll do just that. Thank you, Baba. Rachel, what a pleasant surprise. You are surprised, right? Well, I may have bear grudges against you, but not for the newborn baby. Oh, I am happy you realized that. I'm really sorry, Sam. I now understand where you're coming from. I don't blame you. No man will want to marry me in this condition. I am glad you understand. Well, I'm free now. I have finally seeked for a solution. Wow, are you serious? I am so happy for you. Yeah. So where is the baby? I'd love to meet him or her. That will not be a problem. Come on, come inside. Come inside. All right. That is everything that happened to me, your daughter, to be in this condition now. Oh my god, I never even noticed. Hmm, Baba, can't we do anything to remove this curse from her? I am going to perform a three days ritual on her to remove it. Okay, Baba, there is no problem. Gods of our father. Gods of this land, you said if we do this three days ritual, the curse will be removed from her. Please accept the sacrifice that we have given to you. Gods of our forefathers, gods of my ancestors, please accept the sacrifice. Hello? Good afternoon. Good afternoon, sir. Please, do you know where Bumi's house is? This is her house. Okay, please call her for me. I want to see her. I don't think you can see her all. Wait, let me call her mother for you. Alright. Please, be fast.
Yes, who are you? I am Dr. Great, and this is my wife, Kemi. We came all the way from Lagos State. Okay, so what is the problem? Ma, please, we need your daughter. I am the lecturer at that. Say no more. So after what you did to my daughter, you see had the guns to show your face here. Now get out of my house now. Ma, please forgive my husband. If you do not bring Bumi, he is going to die. Please, I don't want my unborn child to be fatherless. <laughs> please. What a loving wife with a wicked man like you. You don't deserve to have a woman like this. I know, and I truly regret my action. Please, help us. Hmm. I am sorry. I can't help. My daughter went for three days ritual to remove the cause. She is on isolation. You have to wait till next tomorrow. Ha! Ah, and I have two days left. Please. Ma, please put yourself in my shoes. Please help us. What if she comes with you guys and you finally become free? What about our welfare? Do you want us to abandon her three days ritual? Ma, please help us. If you don't, I'm going to die in the next two days. Please, Ma, I beg of you. Mm. Today marks the end of our three days ritual. As from today, the curse will be removed from our head and go far away from this village. Rejoice for everything is done. You are now a free woman. <laughs> Thank you, Baba. Ha, ah, my daughter, I'm so happy for you. You are now free. You can get married and have children now. Mama, I am more than happy. In fact, happy is an understatement. <laughs> Oh Lord, you fair angel of my life. For the love I have is so real. You? What are you doing here? Please get out of this place. I don't want to see you here. Relax, Bumi. They have been here since yesterday. Please, Bumi, forgive my husband. I know what he did was very bad, but please find a place in your heart to forgive him. <laughs> It's alright now. I forgive you. So now, will you be able to follow us to Lagos to meet the native doctor for the sacrifice? Lagos? I'm afraid that is impossible. I can't follow you to Lagos. But why? I'm true with school. This is my hometown. This is where I belong. So I don't have any business with Lagos again. Wait. What if you guys go and meet the native doctor that helped to cure Bumi? He can still help you. That's a good idea. Please, let's go right away. There is no time to waste. Hmm, your case is a critical one. You were told by the other native doctor that Bumi should come with you and your wife should forgive you wholeheartedly. Yes, that's what he said. But the thing is that, have you told your wife the gravity of sins you have committed? Did you tell her the other things you did to the innocent girls? I thought it was necessary. Hmm, remember when you... Please sir, I can't do it. Please don't feel me. I'm a virgin and I'm keeping my virginity for my wedding night. Please, sir, I'm begging you. <laughs> Please don't fail me. Unfortunately, you can't continue to keep it. <laughs> you better give it to me or you'll fail your exams. Please, sir. Please don't fail me. I can't fail any cause. This is my final year. I can't afford to have any career over, sir. Please. I have five younger siblings that are looking up to me, sir. Please, I'm begging you, please. I don't want to lose my virginity this way, please, sir. Then you are not serious. Get ready to feel. <laughs> okay, sir. I'll do it. Good girl. <laughs> now you are talking. That girl.
year he disveggied, the blood cried that day. That blood is ready to seek revenge. But that was in the past. It doesn't matter. Your past is haunting you. Or have you forgotten the girl that came to beg with her mother? I'm gonna love you till I die. Oh, Lolo Femi, Joe. I'm thinking about that day. It'll be just you and I. Yeah, will you be my wife? Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, sir. Ah, good afternoon, madam. Cassie, how can I help you? My daughter told me that you fed her for a course that she passed. She has to carry over the course to next year. Please help us. Well, you see, your daughter here knows what to do. Cassie, what is that? Mama, it's that thing that I told you about. Ha! Huh? Sir, please. She can't do that. Please help us. Sir, I'm begging you. Please help us. Her sister stopped school because of her. Ah, uh, madam. You don't have to do that. Don't worry. I will do something about it. Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. You think bringing your mother to beg me would change my mind, Abby? <laughs> You are not ready to pass. You think you are smart. Foolish girl. Nonsense. Ah! Honey, how could you? Have you also forgotten what you did to that married woman? Please, sir, I can't do it. I'm a married woman and this is against my ethics. Sir, please. Ethics, indeed. It is also against my ethic to make you pass if you don't do the needful. Please sir, please. I feel guilty. When you feel less guilty, you come back next year. Nonsense. So I'm pregnant. You can't sleep with me. I'm pregnant. I don't care if you like. Be pregnant for 20 children. I will get what I want. Please sir, it's delicate. It's just two weeks old. Who cares? You are not ready. Stop wasting my time and get out of my office. <laughs> okay, sir. I'll do it. That woman lost her child two days after. The blood of the unborn child is after you to seek vengeance. In fact, if I start counting all the things you have done, we won't leave here today. Ah, honey, I'm so ashamed of you. I'm really sorry. Please, forgive me. Um, Baba, can't we do anything else, please, to appease the gods? There is only one thing you should do. Please, tell me, Baba. I'll do anything. The only thing you should do is to go and prepare for your death because you are going to die tomorrow midnight. Ah, no, 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 no. I can't die. No, no. Honey, you see? <laughs> Sleeping with a married woman. Ah, I'm so ashamed of you. Now you're going to die tomorrow. I regret. I regret ever marrying a man like you. Now my child is going to grow without a father. <laughs> <laughs> please, Kemi, please, don't give up on me. <laughs> I don't even know what to say to you. You deserve it. Hey, I'm finished. What are you doing here? Please, get out of this place. I don't want to see you here. Please, Bumi. Forgive my husband. Wait, what if you guys go and meet the native daughter that helped to cure Bumi? Your case is a critical one. The thing is that have you told your wife the gravity of sin? Please don't feel me. I'm a virgin and I'm keeping my virginity for my wedding night. Your past is haunting you. Pregnant. You can't sleep with me. I'm pregnant. I don't care if you like, be pregnant for 20 children. There is only one thing you should do. 
please tell me, Baba. I'll do anything. The only thing you should do is to go and prepare for your death because you are going to die tomorrow midnight. I regret ever marrying a man like you. Now my child is going to grow without a father. <laughs> Oh Lolo fair, angel of my life, for the love I have is so real. <laughs> God, what is all this? Of all the men in the world, why did I choose to marry that beast of a man? I'm doomed. I will not be a widow in this lonely world. What did I ever do wrong? My child is going to grow up without a father. Hey! I, I'm so sorry, madam. It's okay. It's not your fault. <laughs> God, why me? Have faith. Your husband is not going to die. I wish it was like that. <laughs> but you heard what the native daughter said. Well, I know, but I feel there has to be another way. We shouldn't just give up like that. Let's go and beg the native daughter again. If possible, offer him some money. I'm sure he'll look for a way. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Wipe your tears, okay? I'm sure your husband will not die. <laughs> okay. Papa, please, there have to be another way. Please help me. Hmm, there is another way, but I'm not sure it's going to stop it. As they say, what we be will be. There is nothing bad in trying. It might work, right? Yes, it might work. Okay, Baba, let's do it. You'll be needing seven different species of snake, and you'll be isolated in a room till the seven days is completed. Okay, but seven different types of snake. But where am I going to get it from? I just have until tomorrow midnight. It's okay. I will tell my boys to get it for you. We just need financial assistance. Okay, Baba. I'll bring any amount you want. So, how many snakes have you gotten? I gotten only three snakes. Just three? Yes, Baba. It is hard to see different type of snakes. You have to be fast. We have only one more day left. I will try my best, Papa. Alright, you may leave. Na, na, na. Oh, Lolo Fair, angel of my life. For the love I have is so real. How can I. Ah, madam, you are still here. Have you eaten anything? No, I haven't. I'm not hungry. Madam, you have to stop worrying. Your husband will be fine. But they have just three snakes out of the seven. We just have one more day left. I even wonder how my husband will be doing in an isolated room. He's fine. You worry too much. Just think about the bright side. Think about how happy you, your husband and your child will be at the end when all this is finally over. Thank you, Bumi. You're a good person. Thank you, madam. Now, you have to eat something, okay? Okay, I will. But what you if... You want to start worrying again, no? <laughs> okay, fine. I give up. It's already the seventh day, and we have just only three snakes. Ghost of our land, please help us. Baba, I have found three more. We may need the last one. That's good. Ma, I want you to look for the last one before night falls. I'm going to pay you any amount. Okay, Baba, no problem. Oh, God. What is keeping them waiting? And the time is 10.15 p.m. I just have a few hours left. God, please don't forsake me. I can't 
just released the snake for you. The species of snake is very rare. It's hard to find. Please, it is very urgent. I'm ready to pay any amount. You mean any amount? Yes, any amount at all. What do you want to use the snake for? We need it to save a life. Hmm, that means it's going to be expensive. Just name your price. Okay, I will sell it 10,000. Here is your money. Now, give me the snakes. I need to return to the village this night as soon as possible. Madam, stop crying. Your husband will be fine. Bumi, <laughs> it's 11.20 p.m. for crying out loud. How will my husband be fine? Don't worry, they'll bring the remaining snake. Just have faith. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Hey God, am I going to get through this? Please save me. I'll never ever do it again. I've learned my lessons. What is keeping this boy? I hope he gets the snake. I really hope he does. Papa, I have the snakes now. Ah, finally. Now let's proceed with the ritual. He has brought the snake! He has brought it! Ah, thank God! You see, I told you to stop worrying. Your husband will be fine. He will not die. Finally, they have brought the snake. Ah, I'm going to be free. Ah, my leg. Ah, ah. Hey. This is so unfortunate. Baba, how is he? Hey, my husband. My husband, please wake up. You can't die. No, you can't die. <laughs> hmm. You see what lust has landed this man into? I tried all I could to make him survive, but the forces were too strong. Hmm. What a poor innocent woman. What shall be, shall be. <laughs> <laughs>